Hello, my name is Mike Kittner, and I want to show you about this new nasty virus. I actually picked it up on YouTube site through a download from watching a particular site. And it actually was called Windows Security Warning. Um, I think it was part of their website is where it came from. But it says it's a Windows Antivirus 2012, which is not. If you get this page, just hit the X in the upper right hand where the little green X was going. And that will actually take you out. But you don't have a virus. It looks like a virus. It looks pretty nasty. But it's actually just a web page that's kind of simulating things. So kind of slow down and take a look at it. And just hit the X to close the window browser safely. But if you don't do that, down on the bottom area, you'll actually see the true uh, danger zone. It wants to actually download the file. But what you can do at this point is just hit the cancel button to actually get out of this particular area. But I'm going to save it just to show you what happens if you actually saved it. Once you save it, I'm actually going to look at the downloads here and actually see what that file is. It's a zip file. So I, I can actually look inside that zip file and actually see what's there. If it's an EXE and you pressed it, you, you actually got the virus. So we'll show you what happens when that actually happens. Keep in mind, do not do this, because if you do this, you'll be doing it. Um, as you can see, this is inside the actual program, and there's a the setup.exe. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to take this file, and I'm just going to drag it to my desktop real quick, and actually show you what this file looks like. This is a bad boy. Now, if I actually double click this, you're really stupid. But I'm going to do it just to show you what happens. There you got it. I have a nasty, nasty virus. As it looks like it's scanning and telling me that I actually have something, it did more than that. It just put hundreds of viruses on my computer and locked out a bunch of features. My ability to load Firefox. Um, I actually can get it if you try two or three times. Firefox will actually load and you can actually make it work but things like the task manager, command line, registry settings, uh, MS config, all those things have been disabled by this virus. So you're pretty much doomed at this point. But if you can run Firefox, you can actually go to a website called MirrorWorldTips.com. They just came out with this fix the same time I actually got this nasty little bad boy. And if you look down through here, um, you can actually try to fix it. I tried to even use a program called Stopzilla sometimes that works. But if you're actually foolish enough to actually buy it, here's the actual registration code just to show you what happens after you put in your credit card and they gave you the registration code. Um, right now, if you gave them your credit card, they are vacationing on your card and your credit. So that's absolutely ridiculous. Never give anybody your credit card at this point. Now, what I'm actually going to show you what happens is is when you actually key in the registration code because uh, you think you might have bought it and the, the problem will go away, that's not true. So I'm going to try my little attempt here to key in the registration number. And once I actually get this keyed in, it really doesn't do anything. It says it fixed the viruses. It did not. It still has locked out all the uh, other programs uh, from you to try to resolve it. Uh, this program is nothing but a huge lie, and you are infected. So good luck trying to get rid of it. It took me about six hours to get this off my machine um, after this little demo, but I just wanted to show you the severity of this issue. Just so you could understand, I have no affiliation with the tools and or websites used to create it or fix this uh, virus. I just wanted to share with you what happens if you don't pay attention to details. So especially this virus because it will ruin your day. My name is Mike Kittner from Amazing Area Photos and Senior.com. Have a great day and good luck.